when people talk about problems, I say to people, yes, it's easy to say you don't have infrastructure in Africa, power is a problem. But I mean, for me, this is a way of life for me. All my life, the road has always been bad. This is the world I know. I try not to complain about it. I try to, to solve it. My name is Afola Bia Biodun. I'm the CEO of SB Telecoms and Devices. Well, our term solution today is solutions that small, medium enterprise work with to manage their operations, their human resource, from recruitment to retirement, from hire to fire. It's simple to use human resource application. I became an entrepreneur because immediately after school, looking for a job was not an option for me. So I started my small business of making phone calls and retailing recharge card. Got a small space, a major road. So what I do in the evening, after the sales I made in the morning, I would go on the road and try to wave cars down and sell to them. I really didn't have any corporate background. You know, I'm coming from the streets to start my business. I got virtually everything wrong, so I learned you know, my lesson the hard way. In 2005, when I had incurred that debt of $100,000, I actually ran away from home, okay, because it was actually my grandmom's property. I was used as collateral for my business then. Banking officer, they went straight to my grandmother and told her, your property will be sold. So start preparing, pack your bag and baggages. We need to evict you. Um, so that for me has actually been one of the things that keeps me going every day. I really need to make her proud, pay up the debt which I have, and do se several other things for myself and my family and my community. In high school, they said, after graduation, 40% of you would get employment and 60% most likely would not. I really didn't want to be part of the problem that government would need to solve. I used my own problem to create a solution we need to build successful businesses that would help eradicate poverty. I've taken upon myself, and we're doing that already, reorientating Africa, and in the process of solving the problem, I'm making myself comfortable, and making my family comfortable, and that's the reason why President Barack Obama would want to meet a special guy like me. Isn't that amazing? So now, the boy from the street invited to the White House for Global Entrepreneurship Summit, it goes beyond myself. I get passion from seeing problems getting solved as expected, and that makes me happy. No matter how small you are, no matter where you operate from, you actually can be anything you hope to become.